Ooh, you know what I forgot to do? This was set up just fine a second ago. Uh, I need to get some ice cream. Let's turn this one on. Battery I love going through my Spotify stuff that's recently played because my son shares it with me and it's like sleep music for cats. <laughs> okay. Uh, copy. Looks cute. It's Jasper. Put my glasses on so I can see better. Alright. Is this? Yeah. Uh, well, let's do this first. knock my easel over and everything on it. Okay. His darkest is not that dark. Maybe a touch darker than this. Too dark, Really, the blackest parts on this dog are his little nose. Let's see here. Oh, it's 
not really what I wanted. I guess this one. There's the slightest. Like, maybe that much lighter. I got a little bit more involved than I planned on it, but that's okay. All right, we are just kind of blocking it in right now. I paint like I play video games, like I'm turning. make some of this up because they don't want the collar which I prefer but I just have to kind of use my imagination down here which is okay just a little bit of the green 
content tab. There we go. Add a little bit more green. And add a little bit more purple. Same thing over here. This is all pretty green. Which is funny because this dog's light looked more yellow. Okay, there we go, gotta love that Van Dyke Brown. I was just working on a painting that's like twice the size and it's always hard to go back to something smaller and like kind of get my bearings. <laughs> this other painting is amazing. I couldn't stream it though because it's a gift.
Schnauzer time. Hey, Nomad, how are ya? It is a schnauzer time. For some reason, it makes me hungry. Like there's gonna be some food involved in this. How are you, Nomad? You're good? Yes! I'm good. I've this is my second painting I'm working on today, which is always nice. I still have so much other stuff to do. I've got an event this weekend and next weekend, and I've got so many prints to make and just general like stuff for the event. But I also have to get these paintings done because they're all commissions. Look at me go, dude. I can't wait to show you the painting that I worked on earlier. It's, it's amazing. Like this pet is my hero. Like I might see if I can make it into prints cause I think it's gonna be everybody else's hero too. You know, it's working well. I ran into a bunch of issues over the weekend with it not printing, like feeding the paper. So I'm troubleshooting all of that and working through all that. I figure out why, but now I've just got to deal with all the crap with it. But it's awesome. It's making beautiful prints. I'm really happy with the way they look. How's your whole greeting card thing going? Did you get that figured out? going good you got it all nailed down and ready to ready to launch <laughs> need my phone call well, I'm like, I guess what get hard, gets hard about some of that too, it's like, I think you were talking about overseas and does that um, affect your like ability to get it all turned around on time? I'm really excited to get in this dog like the nitty gritty I love little like I love fluffy dogs <laughs> they're so much fun yeah that would be a concern of mine as well but I think like for holiday stuff I, I think you're doing well on on time Then again, I don't know when people actually send out greeting cards, so I'm like the worst person to ask. I don't know what you're saying. Oh, they're having strikes going on, I see. That's unfortunate because that's gonna affect everything. And I cannot get my whites white enough for what I want. There we go.
you're going to talk to the print place just south of you. Yeah, are there any, I guess that's it. It's like, I know that like the local printers, like they might, they might be able to get you a good deal. I know my local printer is kind of expensive though. Okay. Sienna, that's gone bad. Hard time seeing colors today. Hate that. Woo! <laughs> About fell over. <laughs> Oh, 
Welcome back. Did you find out anything? Or did you have to leave messages? figure it out though. of Christmas. If you don't get these greeting cards, Christmas won't happen. <laughs> Dude, I just realized we haven't decorated for Halloween. I was like, oops. We're normally really good about it, but life's just been really weird and we've had a lot going on and so I guess if we don't get it decorated for Halloween, it's not the end of the world. I'm not gonna be streaming super long today. I just wanted to go home, pop on and stream. And uh, I'm really just working on getting this dog. Like blocked in and started. But. And then I'm gonna let her dry, him dry. And I've got other stuff I gotta go do. Like prints and all that crap. It's really windy today, and it snowed last night. Fortunately, it wasn't snow that stuck. Didn't it snow there? Yeah, it just, you know, it was gone by the time, um, like, the sun came up. But, yeah, there was definitely snow on the ground. Which is crazy, because that was our first frost warning night. And it snowed on it. Which is bullshit. Just saying. It's absolute bullshit. You turn the heat. It was 62 in your house. Holy smokes. Yeah. It's cold. I have my heat set to like, I think like 65 or something. And then I'll turn on my, since I spend most of my day in my studio or my office, I just keep the house cool and then turn up, turn on space heaters in the rooms. I'm not sure if that's more energy efficient or not, but I feel like it is. Like right now, I don't even have my space heater going, and the heat's turned down low. I don't know. We just have crappy heating and cooling in a lot of our rooms, and so it doesn't really make sense to heat the house if it doesn't work very well. <laughs> Welcome to the Midwest. Dude, I've lived here my whole life, and I, I hate the weather. 
I just really do. I'm trying to be good and I'm trying to embrace it. I just, I don't like it. And every time I think I'm going to try to give it a little bit of a chance, it does something stupid like snows on October 17th, 18th, whatever today's day is. A doggo creepy doggo cancel eyeballs So I went to Target today to get some stuff for my event and I needed some coffee. I bought their Target brand, like Good and Gather. Have you had that brand of coffee? It's really freaking tasty. I got, it's like vanilla bean brulee. It's super yummy, but I'm not gonna sleep tonight. Which right now it's, I don't care, but tonight it's gonna piss me off. Yeah, it's really good. I mean, I honestly, way better than that Pete's shit I got. And you said you, that's what you drink. I did not like Pete's. It was really bitter. This is a lighter roast and we typically go for dark roast. It's just so tasty. Tastes like I'm drinking a fancy Starbucks drink. Well, try it. I would, I would be interested, honestly, in hearing what a snob has to say about the Good and Gather coffee. Well, a coffee snob. You're not just like a snob. <laughs> no, Mad, you're so snobby. Uh, okay. And they want a dark background. Yeah, the Pete's French roast, super bitter. I mean, my coffee maker definitely needs to be replaced. But my husband's of the mindset that it still makes coffee, and he he's the one who drinks most of the coffee. So if he's fine with it, not using all the water in the canister, telling me it needs to be cleaned like every three days after I clean it. That's up to him. Yeah, French press. I like French press and that's definitely the way to go. But I was talking about this the other day. I don't have a um, coffee grinder. When I did cold brew, it was really bitter. What did I do wrong with that? I tried it. I mean, it was good. Like I made like a latte thing, but it was pretty, it was pretty bitter.
You use regular ground coffee and you're a coffee snob. No man. Has to do with the size of the grounds that allows the French press to cook them appropriately, but maybe because you're doing cold brew, it makes a difference. I don't know. That's just really funny. I have a coffee snob friend and like, he was like, do not buy a Mr. Coffee grinder, buy this one. I'm like, it's like, it was like a hundred, two hundred dollars. So I won't buy it, but I also won't buy the Mr. Coffee. Uh, Dunkin' Donuts. I mean, I'm, I drink tea every morning, but I like to make coffee sometimes in the afternoon or the evenings. I like a little dessert coffee. So I like my, I mean, I just make my coffee black too. I don't add anything to it. No cream, no sugar. I, I don't know. I don't drink Starbucks. I've never liked their coffee. I've always thought it was gross. Really bitter. Yeah, super burnt. You're like, ah, it's because you don't add all these things to your coffee. It tastes like shit. You got to add, you know, 14 creamers and <laughs> all this sugar. Was that the app? <laughs> to watch my time. Oh, you can't drink black coffee? That's a shame. I'm sorry you can't. I don't like to put all my calories <laughs> in my coffee. That sucks. <laughs> well, then that, do that, Nomad, because then that way you can get them in time. Or at least you're not running into shipping, potential shipping issues. That would be my, that's, that's the route I would take. And as your business consultant, that's what I'm recommending you do. Yeah, is that the route you're gonna go? Okay, yay, well, Christmas is gonna happen then. Well, do pre-orders on it. So then if you, and do it like I have to meet 100 if I don't meet it. Then maybe you don't even order it and then you're not out the money if it doesn't, if it doesn't pan out. I don't know. I know some people don't like that.
especially if they're purchasing it, purchasing it for their holiday cards and they're relying on it. They need something that's reliable. I get that. So maybe that's not a good idea. I'm just trying to help you. I get that. Like expense sucks. pants I'm wearing are like uncomfortable to be painting in. I had other pants on today and I ended up running errands so I took those pants off because they were scrubs. It's a good start. 100 is bad. You have a holiday art thing going on here. Okay well there you go. You know, I need, I really ought to take the time to design some sort of like holiday card thing. I also need to find some winter events because I don't have any events after October. Yeah, that works. What sizes are you ordering on them then? Yeah, good, good. I'm glad you're going that route. I think I think that's a good route to go. You know what you should do is find like a cute happy holiday stamp and offer that, that they can purchase it or they can opt to have it stamped on the inside and you stamp it on each card for like an extra dollar fifty or some something. I don't know. I have like a couple holiday stamps and I use them for my cards. Like during the holiday season. Like my thank you cards, but I don't know. That would be cute. They'll be five by seven. for the A6 so it's like a little bit smaller is what I'm printing for mine I think either is great though Yeah, that's not worth it. I think it's nice though, because it's a pretty like winter card that they could still send. Like it could be a pretty like get well soon for the like, winter themed. And I think it's gonna make it more um, versatile. really do need to shut down. Got a, got something I have to do that's time sensitive. I 
eye doesn't look quite right. I couldn't get the photo to load to like put it on my streaming screen. It, I mean, it was just loading sideways and I don't know why and I ran out of time, so. There we go. Cute little doggy. All right, Nomad. I, I mean, a 45 minute stream, that's not bad. It was better than nothing. I did not stream yesterday. I had gone to a concert on Saturday, Sunday night and I was, I'm already half deaf and I was like, I think 80% deaf yesterday and I felt really discombobulated and the ringing wouldn't stop in my ears and sound frequencies hurt. It was awful. My ears hurt. I felt like crap yesterday. I couldn't move my neck. <laughs> so sore from head banging. So I'm better today. But <laughs> I uh, definitely wanted to stream then since I didn't get to yesterday. I didn't paint yesterday. I felt so yucky. It's still, I think I might be getting a little cold thing. So I'm taking lots of vitamin C. Not gonna let this shit get me down. There we go. You need to get to painting? Are you streaming today? You've had a computer now. You'll be on Discord. Oh no, I'm sorry, Nomad. I was wondering where you've been. That's a bummer. But you've been on Discord. Cool, I'll see if I can pop in later. And uh, hang out. Are you doing I guess you can't do any like video feed you're just doing audio like a you know what I'm saying just chatting like to go farther with this today but that is okay I got where I got I can you might have it fixed good I hope you can get it fixed here oh I don't know I don't know I don't know enough about all of this to troubleshoot like that Well, yeah, maybe something's wrong with your cable, too. Maybe your cable's compromised. Doesn't like that. It's too much work. I feel like we're running a 20 mile run. Okay, I gotta go. Thanks for hanging out with me, Nomad. I'll see if I can drop in with you later with everything. Um, I will try to. You have a good day. See ya!